right, dog. Is it recording? Three weeks on the road. Stories to be told. So listen to Mr. Shiny Water guide you along through the trials and tribulations of some good old boys. Our story begins way out west in the Golden State. The Los Angeles County line to be exact. The boys at Trans World rented a 36 foot RV for a three week journey through the great Northwest. Barley, and then there's Clint, Mr. Wilden, Hairball, good old Matt Dove, Judd, and Ped taking them photos. Woo! The first thing on the agenda was just to fuel up. Founders in a bind. Not to run into the gas pump. Not one trick on film yet, except for this one right here. How long have you been on the trip, Duffy? Five minutes. <laughs> what happened? Bad luck, man. I jinxed us. Oh, with the damage done to that RV, the boys got going and drove all evening to Grass Valley, California. Teeth brushed and itching to skate, the boys cruise the RV toward the skate park. skate park around, does it? Rain. Go away. to the call of the rain, the boys had to head on back to the RV. But lucky, lucky day, oh, look who's here. Man lost me too. You know what? I won 500 bucks in these seats. What? Skrills. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was a seven and two other things that were like triple and triple. So it was like, and I played two quarters on it. Two quarters? 
That's it. That rips, yeah. man. It's the best thing that could have happened to you today. <laughs> Without a doubt. I want to get lost, man. <laughs> Good old Pat Duffy put a hurting on that skate park. It was time to leave Reno. Bug RV. The, the lines in the ground, you can hardly even see them. Then it had eight million bugs up there. I'm like, steady rambling through the evening. Klamath Falls was reached. Jesse hitched on the traveling RV, which led to the restaurant door. Okay, as long as we get you fed. Mmm, sit down to homemade food, get up on the homemade skate spot. Who knew that Duffy would find joy riding that? When wide open, beautiful skate parks lay just down the road.
But Mr. Duff is soaring like an eagle. He made everybody feel kind of sleepy. The boys was busy sawing logs and laying around. Northward bound, Wesleyan, Oregon was taken on by the traveling RV. Lynn to Portland, the RV became filled with a gruesome smell. Ooh, damn, dump it. What does it smell like, Clint? I can't smell anything. It smells great. <laughs> what does it smell like to you? It smells like shit. Oh, God almighty, dump that thing. Send them boys to Burnside. The body can only take so much. For old Mr. Wilbur, this was a little too much on the knee. So I had to leave him behind on account of an injury. Next thing you know, they was out looking for a country swim.
bless you. But somebody's thirst was not quenched. Old Clint Peterson had a day with a speed bump. some friends at Donald for a bright light pool session. get to bed so they could get up early. Looking good, Mr. Duffy. Time to go to the airport. Boys got to drop off Jesse Fritch and old Matt Duff for a switcheroo. That's right, Danny Way and Jake Brown jumped on the moving RV. And oh yeah, that boy Danger joined in. Having known the area well, he took the boys over to Ballard Bowl.
night fell on Seattle, and Mr. Donnie Baller was feeling a little street neglect. He decided to switch it up. Sure enough, he did it next try. Now you take a 36-foot traveling RV and you stick it on a 275-foot floating ferry boat. Check into the skate park. Now Danny got his way with that line, and soon after that, it was time to say the goodbye. Right on. Good ride with you. Yeah, yeah, I'm good too, man. Christ here in the big air. Christ here in the big over the hip. Later, Matt. After a quick meal, the fellas had to rush to the ferry, because time was running out for an evening in Seattle, Washington. We are launching balloons at any random person or cop that drives by. Oh, oh, <laughs> Let's get another one, dude. Now, Hairball wasn't howling, but he was pretending to be Team Wolf way too late at night. Early morning came, these boys were tired, and that same old bumper was a flopping on the freeway. What'd you do? Stress was on. Time had to get moved. There was somewhere to be. Yeah, it'll make the fair. Where it was, you'll find out.
and evening fell on Orcas Island. Brother Jake decided to call up some daggers. Hell was about to get broke through. Let's play dice. Hey, let me go get my money. Yeah. Ah! Nice. That was good action. That's what it's about. That's good action. Oh, my goodness, it's an action out here. Woo! We had a final die for the team. Raging like that, something is bound to get towed up. Oh. Oh, what happened last night? Dude. That's what it's all about, dude. You have a whole cherry pear kit in the RV. It's just got to sit in place for a little while. That's the only thing it's got to do. As Danny was making necessary repairs, other things needed tending to. How's it going? Pretty good. Are we going to be able to get another room for the night? No. Nope. There's no way? No. Nope. We had asked you how many people were staying in the room, and I don't know the exact number, but I mean, I heard it was 40. And... I mean, we don't even know 40 people on the island. The thing about it is, is the police department know about it. I'm, I'd be surprised if you find a place to stay on the island. Sorry, we, uh... But I accept your apology, and I you guys trouble. need to leave as soon as possible. All right. Thank you. After this mess, it was time to get off the island and back to the mainland. And of course, Washington. I'm here after all the other places. <laughs> Weird. of a pool over in Bellingham, Washington for an eight night session. Maybe these boys should hobble on back to the RV and get ready for a big day tomorrow. So what's the deal here? Clean up time. We're gonna try to cross the border. Notice I said to try. What do you think will happen? Well, some of us will make it. There'll be some casualties. Some, some people will go down, I'm sure. So the boys had to get their story together. How long were you for? Three days. We're staying at a nice hotel in town? No, we're staying at an RV park on the north side of Vancouver. Uh, Alex said that they want to hear about us spending a lot of money. When you say holiday, we're not here skating. Uh, are we already here? Now, how do they expect to oh, get man. through Canada? Is it okay? No. Nah. If they can't even drive across the border. It's so tight, man. I don't even see how they expect right. an RV to get through. Man, it's tight in here. We have 11. How many times have you guys been here? Twice. Everybody's been at least once. We're just on a skate trip. We're just taking a vacation. Well, we're at the border and we're denied access, so we're all kind of bummed. Spent five hours at customs. Some of us got some prior offenses. You were straight, right? I pulled it. I don't know how. But it's... Uh, clean as a whistle, man. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> they don't think I'm a U.S. citizen. Okay. Huh? What's the problem? I'm criminal. Hi, what's the citizenship? U.S. All? 
Yeah. Do you want your trip to Canada? We didn't even get we didn't in. We didn't even get in. Why not? We got all these. Got all these people. people. Said they wanted a thousand bucks. That sound right to you? Well, it's their country, and they've got some real <laughs> bizarre things. Unwelcome at the borders of Canada, the boys turn back to the U.S. of A. Seattle, Washington. Uh, the mirror was about to fall off again. How'd it fall off? The boys were in desperate need of some first aid, so it was time to round up the appropriate supplies. What I need is a syringe so I can drain my knee, but I don't know if I can buy those here. I'm gonna get this patented three strap design knee brace right here. I'm telling you, if you want support, is that what you're looking for? Then that's not gonna do a damn thing. That, that one will give you support. Knee brace, 20 ibuprofen, and I'm good to go. With supplies in hand, the posse was ready to get loosened up for a good day's worth of skateboard. a session like that, nothing can go wrong. Or could it? Are you all drunk or what? We have permission. Yeah, we're on some or what? <laughs> Just broke a $5,000. That's too bad. Everybody out of here now. Yeah. Watching. What the hell are you doing to my yeah. property? What the hell are you doing breaking $5,000 cameras? $5,000 cameras. Well, the camera got lost in the scuffle, but the boys were shown their way to a schoolyard where Danger had to take on something that had never been done. All the inspiration Danger put into Duffy's mind got set loose in the same procedure, but with different sneakers. Well, now Danger had his eye on a little something more, and you don't get a name like Danger for no reason. sitting on my back actually. It's like my spine is crushed in a million pieces. Head kind of hurts a little bit. Eyes definitely hard to see out of. 
don't really have any memory of what the hell happened. Keep in mind that danger makes how much money skateboarding? Zero. So what was your diagnosis? There's no break in my foot, but there's a fracture in my big toe. I felt like some pop in my foot, you know, but I just it was right when all that crap went down with the old guy, you know, so I just, the way I folded my foot, I can't go point the toes kind of thing, you know, but keep ice on it. Hopefully I'll be straight in two days or so. I don't remember why we were here. <laughs> it was trying to get into Canada, is that what we were doing? The hardest slam I've ever seen a person in my life in, in real life, definitely by far. So you know what we're doing, right? You know what we're filming and stuff? Yeah. Yeah, why we're What's your status right now? Useless. <laughs> I mean, I can skate, like, it's no big deal. Like, it doesn't hurt to, like, jump around and shit. It's just like, dude, if I bury these guys, two punch caps. <laughs> yeah. Put it this way, dude. I'm looking good, dude. Compared to dangerous setup. Keeping true to his word, Danny did what he had to do. So, what's the deal here? What are you going in for? I'm trying to get my knee drained out. There's a bunch of fluid in there. It's making it kind of hard to bend. There's too much pressure inside it. So hopefully get it drained out and get back on the program. Number three on the injured list. We've all got our certificates now. This is the moment. Here's a poke. Some people make them sick. It, for some reason, it makes me motivated. Look at the size of that needle. Now we're talking. I'm not there yet. Okay. Okay, I'll just take this guy out here. We haven't tapped the zone yet? No, we're not there yet. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Meanwhile, Clint went down the road to check out the handrail scenario. Stop. Yeah, I think we're good. We've got some on the way out, but I don't want to poke around in there too much. No. It's going to aggravate it. Okay. This is a glamorous side of skateboard, huh? How do you know that hurt? It hurts. Do you have any questions? One real cool. Making yeah, sure we got some spring left in this thing. Hey, take care. Thanks. If I can get some more skating on, then it's always worth it. I mean, I'm here to skateboard. I'm not here to um, waste any time, you know, so it's either I get back in action or I get home. A little vacation and then back at it. We're hoping that there won't be any more visits to the hospital, but street skating is welcome anytime. Danger had to get on home. Today. He needed some R&R &R for sure. Take care of the dome. See you guys later. Now Danger said his farewell, but Danny Way wanted to try out some skateboarding. After only one day of that knee poking needle time. So it was time to get on the road again, headed east toward Haley, Idaho, where the boys' trip came to an end. Come on, Duffy. Let's do this. Wasting videotape. Costing us money.
shaving my head. That's a weird LA haircut. Despite little setbacks along the road, the boys managed and had quite an adventure. Smells <laughs> 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 great. Oh, right there. This is a glamorous side of skateboarding. Hey now, get the game on. Oh, what is the action out here? That's what it's all about, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone left with smiles on their faces and memories to last a lifetime. I'm sure they'll do it again one day. So should you. Pick up that old skateboard and get out on the open highway. here we don't know where that went what there was some screens back here yeah I think the screen got thrown out okay come here I have uh, I think it used to go right here this, this one, you know the clothes that's broken what we did was we gave them some extra towels hopefully that'll replace the damage on that looking pretty good here we have this piece not quite sure exactly you know where it goes but Oh, yes, the exterior uh, damage. Uh, I believe we got shirts for that. We should be all right. Just plug in. I forgot how big the tail was. It's the first time I had it. And I kind of clipped it. It wasn't like a direct. Yeah, it's okay. But I guess I think that it's still Oh, no, 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 no. What is your idea to tie it up with us? Should like yeah? <laughs> it, it'll fall? If you don't, if you don't set it, it's going to fall off. What happened here? We were attacked by a wolverine, actually. You must know. The bear? We pretty much taped it up, though. I think it's good to go. I mean, it's good as new. At least the, the, the windshield is not broken. Is there a reason why you have the camera pointing at me? You're a beautiful end to a horrible vacation. 
Well, they said that we could pay a fee for the cleaning, right? Yes, we can. Are you guys crazy? <laughs> what happened to the door? What happened to the uh, carpet when I see the detective? Where does that go, anyway? Yeah. It goes right here. Huh. I guess we could probably hang that right back up there, huh? Are you guys using it as a pin here, or what? Honestly, none of the damage was intentional. You know yeah. when you're, like, fiddling with something, you come to a big stop, and the door breaks. We kept it, though. Yeah, oh, you kept it. We yeah. were going to get some Elmer, Elmer's glue going, but that would help we couldn't solve. find any. The shower's pretty good. That's in good shape. At least the shower is in one piece. Amazing, isn't it? Yeah, I'm surprised. Okay, how many more surprises do you have? The truth, honestly, yeah. I think everything from there on up here is actually just fine. You have your, your other charges, which includes two damages, which is $200 each. The side mirror, $75. Cleaning, $50. Inside is $60. Um, your balance total amount, grand total for the rental, um, it actually came out to $7,371.84, and that includes... <laughs> Can I please have you serve sign right there and Dave right there? So does that make a difference to you? Not really, no. And I was, and I was feeling bad to you. I'm like, oh no, I don't feel bad. bad. Uh, I mean, I was like, oh, so hopefully I don't get fired or anything. I'm gonna throw up the horns. That's all I'm doing right now. <laughs>